Hey guys, just uh, popping into Trifield and um, picking up some bits and pieces. It's Valentine's Day. I love you all. <laughs> uh, happy Valentine's Day to you all. Um, yeah, I've just got to go and get some bits and pieces. It's, uh, I've already given the wife her flowers and card uh, so that's been done uh, I haven't paid £10 for delivery bloody ridiculous price for delivery that and uh, I'm just getting some stuff because I'm going to be cooking at home tonight normally we'd have takeaway tonight uh, but uh, it's still all causing problems with the, the wife's uh, false teeth and that she won't go out. Well, she would, but she's, she's not keen on going out at the minute. And we are actually going out tomorrow night. Um, well, I'm not sure if it's tonight or so, like late afternoon. And it's actually for it's actually for my dad's birthday. Um, he is 70 this year. Uh, you know, his birthday's not actually till the 25th. Uh, but it couldn't be sort of like fitted in and uh, what we're doing, we're doing it at the golf club in Bridlington where they are members of. Uh, I think uh, obviously, I mean, he's just going to be a social member uh, now. Uh, I don't think he's going to be doing golf again. Uh, he's, he's keeps wittering on, he wants to go and play uh, snooker. <laughs> um, couldn't do it right now, definitely not. So uh, anyway, I'm going to go and get some stuff and I'm just going to cook something at home. Uh, I think I'm just going to have some, I don't know, hunter's chicken and veg or something like that. The wife likes that. So, so uh, yeah, because I'm out tomorrow, hence I'm doing the vlog uh, today, because normally I would do it on a Sunday, although I think I did it uh, Saturday last week as well, didn't I? So, what have I got to tell you? Uh, the dogs have all had a, a muzzle cut. <laughs> uh, they were all just getting a bit scruffy, so they've had the muzzles cut, not they, they haven't had a full body cut yet, because it's still a bit on the chilly side for them. Although it's seven degrees today. Uh, it's definitely too chilly for the old man. Um, so they've all just had the muzzles done, and they, they all look a little, uh, a little odd at the minute but cute at the same time so if I can if I remember I'll get some in the footage in for you so you can see them um, but yeah it's uh, yeah, it's been a bit odd uh, so uh, we're getting we're starting to sort of like pick up a bit of work getting a bit busier um, but we're still waiting for some stock to come in so we can sort of do stuff you know but I've done quite a lot of uh, local deliveries I mean, I've been to Hull twice this last week, uh, just with all like local stuff and that. And so, you know, some sides of things are getting quite busy. Um, and I was away. It wasn't my own. It wasn't this week. Gone was it? it was the week before. I was at Chepherd Hundred. Uh, then I've got. I think this coming week. We're not sure which we're going to be doing yet, but we're going to be doing. Either uh, Milton Keynes, or we might be going across the other side of the country and doing um, well, it'd be two if we go that way. We'd be doing Bristol and Cardiff at the same time. So they're just so far out. You need to be, you know, getting as much in as you can for that sort of travel. Um, and then I've got another one coming up as well, which is a stupid little one. Um, where is it? Um, Crew, which is an absolute nightmare. And it's a tiny little job, really, Crew, as well. You know, it's, it's a lot of travel for not a massive amount of work, but the travel is huge. Just looking at some kids uh, 
one of them's getting a bit upset, so I don't know whether they've been fighting or something. Um, so yeah, you know, other than that, it's, you know, sort of same old, same old. Um, Stopping smoking is going well. Um, get a little irate sometimes. I've had some. I've picked up some bits from IKEA. Delivery's horrendous, um, and I probably could have gone and collected myself. It's, it's quite annoying, really, the delivery charges from IKEA. Although <laughs> the driver, when he dropped it off, he said it's uh, from IKEA. Uh, he says we've got to call it IKEA now because it, it sounds posher. <laughs> I've always just called it IKEA. Um, so anyway, I've uh, but yeah, the stuff turned up this morning, and uh, what it is, I'm making some more uh, shelves. And what I use is I use the uh, I think it's called the Lin Linmon Linmon. It, it's like a black uh, grain effect. Obviously, it's not real wood. Uh, it's, it's in like a, a black with a slight red grain tinge added to it, uh, which is the same as my desk. Uh, although I wish I'd gone with something that didn't show the dust up quite as badly, but there you go. Um, so that's, but yeah, I've got the, so I've got two more pieces of that uh, to meter by 600. They'll get cut in half for some meter by 300 shelves. Uh, then I've still got to go and pick up some brackets uh, that are the same as the ones I've already got from... No, I have to get those... I have to get those from B&Q, but I have to get them from the one in Hull, because the one in Bridlington is so useless and lame that it doesn't have them in. Um, so I've got those to do. Uh, but I also got, finally, uh, got <laughs> a new mirror for my bathroom, because the other one just shattered one morning uh, Basically, well, the, the bottom brackets rotted on it, although it had been up nine years and it dropped and just smashed all over the bathroom. Uh, but I finally got this other mirror and I was going to put it back up on the same brackets. I unwrapped it all and everything and they've changed the, the, the bracketing system on it. So I'm coming here to get some bits of food and then I'm just going to pop to work while I'm out this way and pick up my tools because I'm going to have to drill some fresh holes in the bathroom wall. So. <laughs> Sorry, I couldn't resist. <laughs> yeah, couldn't resist that. Uh, saw some uh, cheese and onion rolls as I was going round, so. You always get one, don't you? Park as tight next year as they possibly can. Wouldn't be so bad, but it was his driver's side as well, so he'd actually made it awkward for himself to actually get out of the damn thing. So yeah, that was that was what I meant to tell you earlier. Um, the wife, the wonderful person that she is, went and bought me some new jeans. Come on, what are you doing? That's it. So yeah, bought me some new jeans. Very nice jeans. I'm wearing them now. And uh, when I pointed out to her. about uh, modern day shopping and how the pockets have to be big enough for uh, certain items to fit. She said she was not going to buy my clothes based on, <laughs> based on being able to get my six plus in the pocket. So there you go, they don't, they don't, they don't quite fit, the pockets are a bit shallow. So now I'm going to have to go and get a, I don't know, I'm going to have to go and get a bit of surgery, I think. That's what he said anyway. <laughs> um, so yeah, it, uh, it just pokes out a bit at the top. Wait, it, it fits. It's all right for walking around, but the minute I want to sit down, uh, it's not going to fit. Now, obviously, I only use the front pocket. I wouldn't, I wouldn't dream of being one of these stupid idiots that puts it in the back pocket and sits on it. Uh, you need your head looking at so, um, but anyway, what you guys been up to uh, this week? I can see the comments now. Work. <laughs> Don't worry. <laughs> it was a 
was all looking cute with your muzzle cuts. Eh? Yeah. <laughs> oh, nice. They always show you up, don't they? Mm. What you got? What you got? Playing with your chip. And they're just waiting to nab it. They've actually all just been very healthy and been eating um, some carrot. <laughs> they love fresh carrot. So I've got my veg on and I'm just warming the oven up. Uh, which is just about reached temperature so I can get my hunter's chicken in and um, uh, while I was waiting I just thought I'd have a game of Jenga to myself go. So, damn it I'll just have to eat them all now tea was rather nice um, just having a brew made sure I've got the right um, cup because uh, nearly Thought, I thought I'll do a vlog in a minute and I thought well if I pick up the wrong cup and start vlogging with it and then just for suddenly to have a drink without thinking you would end up seeing this <laughs> we've had that a while that one um, I don't know who got it um, rather unpleasant but uh, it can be amusing to give it to certain people sometimes, that is for sure. So, um, yeah, I'm going to um, wrap up anyway today. Uh, I mean, it's what time we are? We're at 20 to 7 now. So, but yeah, I've had tea, I'm just having a brew, and uh, I'm just going to sort of settle in for the night. Um, I'm sure I'll start uh, the odd Twitter conversation here and there. Um, unless you're all out on your lovely romantic Valentine dates, which you should be, by the way. So if you're not and you answer my tweets, I want to know why. Although I'm sure there'll be loads of uh, posh foodie tweets all over Instagram. Uh, hashtag food porn. <laughs> so, um, but yeah, my hunter's chicken was nice anyway, so... The wife enjoyed hers. I just had it with some new potatoes, beans and carrots. So, um, so yeah, anyway, um, take it easy, guys. Um, do comment underneath. Let me know what you're doing, you know, if you're going out for a Valentine's Day, anything like that, you know, with your uh, respective other half. And uh, I hope you all end up having a really happy Valentine's Day. And I will uh, catch you all in the next one. So do take care guys, see you later.